thousands of Hoosiers are coming together today inside of Gamebridge Fieldhouse to pack food for those in need. It's all part of what's known as the annual Million Meals Marathon. WRTV's Adam Shumes joins us live as the volunteers. They're getting ready to pack up all that food to, for a great cause. Adam, good morning to you. Now you're indoors and still looking good on this Tuesday morning. You know, love the compliments from y'all. Good morning. I um, promise you all morning long that we would be inside Gamers Fieldhouse finally making way. Hey, we're inside the concourse here where the Million Meals Marathon will be taking place. It's all an effort to feed uh, hungry Hoosiers out there and just give back to those in need. All morning long, we've been joined by Mr. Chris Evans with the Million Meals Marathon, 12th year in a row. What has been yeah. the big difference the last 12 years? Yeah, you know, obviously it's grown, uh, a lot more volunteers. If we go all the way back, uh, we've been able to get together 17,000 volunteers and 33 million meals so far. Um, obviously the COVID, COVID environment set us back a little bit and we had a call on Audible last year. So we started here and we had to pivot over to the state fairgrounds, but excited to be back here inside Gainbridge uh, to try to pack a million meals today. Yeah, the goal is a million meals. What is that going to mean to all those hungry Hoosiers out there? Yeah, you know, the food has a big impact in our community that we all live in um, by putting out these meals into the food banks like Midwest and Gleaners. Uh, so all these meals will be packaged up. The food banks will be here to take them and distribute them out to the community where they need them the most. You talk about all these meals going back to all these food banks. What do the food banks tell you about what today means, especially for them? Yeah, absolutely. So uh, what we hear is that it used to be one in five Hooser families had food insecurity. Unfortunately, with COVID, that number is now one in four. So the need has never been greater to help support our community. Perfect. Chris, thank you so much. I know you, I know you promised you me you'd get me I down promise. to the floor. We're getting down to the floor next half an hour. We'll take you down to the floor where all the volunteers will be getting ready to package meals for all Hoosiers out there. If you need more information on how you can get involved, we do have a link for you in this story on our website, WRTV.com. But for now, we're live inside Gambridge Fieldhouse this morning working for you. Adam Shumes, WRTV.